Gok in Chief Southwest Command Lieutenant General Amradeep Singh Bhinda on Saturday asked the passing out team our cadets in Dehradun to uphold the great traditions to which they belong and live with moral and professional standards that make them role models for the coming generations. You walk in the tradition of military leaders like Field Marshal Sam Manik Shaw and warriors like Major Somnath Sharma, 2nd Lieutenant Arun K. Tripal and Captain Vikram Batra, to name just a few of the great alumni the Academy has produced. The best way to honor them is to live with moral and professional standards which make you role models for the generation to come, he said, addressing 377 gentlemen cadets who passed out of the Indian Military Academy and commissioned into the armies of their respective countries. The number includes 288 Indian gentlemen cadets and 89 gentlemen cadets from eight friendly foreign countries, including Afghanistan. The EMA is more than just a fine institution of learning. It is the guardian of values that have shaped officers who shaped the military destiny of this country for more than seven decades, he said. Lieutenant Jen Binder said they needed a warrior's strength and a scholar's knowledge and wisdom to become effective military leaders. He said the dynamics of combat are changing worldwide, most of it driven by technology. A modern-day military leader must embrace this technological drift and understand the seamless synergy required between men and machines. As military leaders, you have to lead young men and women into combat. One thing that was common among all great military leaders was that they all had genuine care and interest for the people they commanded and their families, he said, asking them to cultivate the quality of caring for the people they command with respect and humility. Being commissioned into the army is an honor bestowed on them by the country, but it also places upon their young shoulders the formidable responsibility of not only ensuring the country's defense but also evoking in people through their conduct respect for the uniform that they wear. Lieutenant Jen Bhinder said being in the army is being in the noblest profession, which lets you serve the nation with altruistic devotion. He praised the GCs for their immaculate turnout and sterling drill display during the passing out parade saying they showed their superlative training standards. The coveted sword of honor went to Academy Cadet Adjutant Mawson Vats, while Academy Under Officer Neeraj Singh Papola got the gold medal.